What's going on guys? This is Ryan with RK Outpost and a voice actor for a very popular Call of Duty character has been fired. He has been terminated from Activision after some clips resurfaced and were spread around the internet with the intent to get him cancelled with some things that people are claiming are misogynistic remarks. Some of them towards a certain streamer. Some of them just shit talking people in the chat. I'm gonna let you listen and judge for yourself whether you think he deserves to be fired for this. But let's look at the story. This is from Call of Duty news. Activision has cut ties with Jeff Leach, the voice actor of Ghost in Modern Warfare and Warzone, after sexist comments made by Leach resurfaced on social media. And by resurfaced, of course, they mean someone put them together. They clipped all of these things together with the intent to get him fired, to get him canceled. And that's exactly what ended up happening. Here is the report from Charlie Intel. Activision ends relations with the recasted voice actor behind Ghost. Activision has cut all ties with Jeff Leach, the voice actor behind Call of Duty Modern Warfare's Ghost Operator, after sexist comments made by Leach resurfaced on social media. Of course, he was recast for the 2019 reboot. He's not the original actor who played Ghost. All those voices were recast. The news of Activision ending their working relationship with Leach comes as sexist comments made by Leach have resurfaced online after streamers and community members were questioning why Leach still had partners within the industry. A Twitter thread posted reveals just some of the sexist comments Leach made about streamer Zombie Unicorn and in the thread asked why he still has partnerships with Facebook Gaming and Activision. That's how these people do it. They try to get people deplatformed from everywhere because they said a couple things things that they don't like or don't agree with. Uh, this is the person who put this out. Nitro Luke DX, Jeff Leach, misogynist, Facebook gaming partner, voice of Call of Duty Vo Ghost Activision. Serious, personalized, intrusive sexism, influence, contempt, violence, serial offender at the zombie unicorn. Again, the whole intent of this is to get this man fired, to get this man canceled. Watch the clip, retweet, respect women, hashtag game over for sexism. What a fucking cuck this dude is, to be honest. But let's listen, uh, let's listen to what Jeff Leach has to say in some of these clips. No wonder why Zombie Unicorn didn't want to come on. She didn't want to come on, yeah. <laughs> that has to that actually be reason. amusing. Yeah, that is the she reason. She couldn't just so rely here, on here we uh, go. horrendous cleavage. I said it. On Twitch. I meant it. So that was obviously talking about Zombie Unicorn, a shot at Zombie Unicorn. Okay. Jeff, be a nice guy right now. You came here because you're a fucking simp with a saggy vagina. That's why you came over here. By the way, you can go back and tell that fuckboy that he wouldn't say any of that shit to my face. Because I'm a giant. I'd crack him in half, which is what I would do to you if you weren't so fucking Battle ugly. Royale. Do me a favor, oh, darling. See yourself out and don't let the door hit your fat ass on the way out. I love how it's always like some- So he's obviously on stream talking shit because there's someone talking shit to him in chat. This is something that happens. I don't know if anyone's ever watched a stream before. If you've ever watched a fucking gaming stream, uh, these are the kind of things that happen. It's, it's pretty fucking normal. Dirty, dirty, gross, fucking looking emo bitch who looks like she fucking has no chance of getting a bit of dick in her. See you later, Leah. Suck my fat, girthy cock, you stupid cunt. I don't give a shit. You're gone. You're done. You're banned. You're out of here. That shit's not coming into my community. This footage shows 37-year-old Jeff Leach abusing young females. It is equal opportunity verbal abuse when you're playing video games. That's how it, how it always has been. That's how it always should be. You shouldn't go easy on people just because of their gender. Talking shit is a part of the game. And if you can't fucking handle it, don't fucking play. So after that video, uh, serious and unforgivable sexism. It follows that Jeff Leach does not respect women as equals. So as girl gamers, what do we do as a collective? to change the way certain males view women. We speak out. I mean, if you're Take silent, stand. ultimately, yep. If, if silence ultimately is part of the problem, right? If you see something or you're aware of something and you choose to let it slide because maybe it doesn't bother you, right? I'm very hard to offend. So let's say maybe that didn't offend me. If I chose to not say something, I'm then part of the problem. You know, and, and for him to take it as a comedic joke about our female, like how our physique is, 
it just it's just appalling because there are so many stereotypes as it is with females as it is and then for us to be the minority in a gaming community it just adds to everything that is being said So 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 let's just be sure now so none of these women should ever say anything disparaging about a man or a man's body ever you should never comment on the size of their cock you should never say anything like that you should never say anything derogatory towards a male then either right if you're upset that someone's taking shot at a woman about body parts that's what you're saying right are you sure you want to be held to that fucking standard I don't think so. Does that mean by affiliation that Facebook is okay with what's being said? I don't know. Unfortunately, perception is reality. And because it's being allowed to continue, the perception then is that Facebook or Activision is okay with, with those things being said. Standing together. There you go. Exactly. They are trying to cancel this dude by getting all of the different people he associates with pulled. Instead of building their own platforms, instead of actually being entertaining, you have all of these people that would rather, <laughs> that would rather take other people's platforms away. That's what is going on right now. Now, if you are Activision and all these things come out, I don't know what his contract with them looks like. I don't know what kind of clauses there are. I do know that this wouldn't happen if there weren't a bunch of people, right? If there weren't a bunch of people that were trying actively to get the man canceled. And then, of course, Zombie Unicorn, Zombie Unicorn, go ahead, goes ahead and retweets it and says, tags all the people that he's associated with and said that they continue to overlook prejudice, malice behavior by cis white men like Jeff Leach. And it's always about cis white men. But uh, there you have it. Jeff Leach, no longer a part of Activision. He has been canceled. He has been fired. Uh, did he deserve it though? That's my question to you. Uh, I think the idea that maybe he's not a voice actor for Activision anymore, maybe they have some kind of contract, the idea that because he's talking shit online that he gets departnered from all these people, which is the goal, which is the end goal for him to be deplatformed, I think that's absolutely insane. But let me know what you think. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching, everyone. And a huge shout out to my patrons. I appreciate you guys so much. Want to follow me on Twitter or Instagram? Check out the description below. You'll find links to my P.O. Box and my Patreon as well. And I'll talk to you guys later.